So, uh, let's go check out these challenges. Yeah. I'm sure we have some. Any more challenges specifically for Liz's ability, immaculate ability to pronounce French? <coughs> Not currently. Mm. I mean, you know what to do, chat. French. Um, yeah, because she's good. She's so good. She's so good. Despite being an American, it sounds like she was born in a French speaking oh, I nation. Know. It's amazing. It really, really putting the romance I mean, really, into romantic we just need languages. Any product here in Canada because it's all in French and English, so we <laughs> can find anything in the kitchen likely. Yeah, as the most Canadian of all of the Desert Bus chefs, Don Guard officially brought to you in both official languages. <laughs> hmm. James, my legs hurt so much. Why? Why? Because of the stupid coffee pong challenge you did yesterday. I don't. I definitely feel like. I miss coffee pong. I lost the hardest challenge. I, I mean, I think of all the punishments we have up there. I don't know if they get any worse than what I had to do yesterday. I mean, yeah, physically for sure. I mean, I was pretty sad on uh, Saturday um, when I couldn't drink any coffee. But I could just go to sleep and now I'm fine. Whereas yeah. now you are suffering the effects um, for days for twenty four at least twenty four hours later on. So I mean that's pretty good. Yeah, I well, mean basically what we want is you to, uh, you know, just not not be able to perform tomorrow when we return to <laughs> return to the tables. We so. need to um, we need to brainstorm a replacement for that challenge we did as well, right? Oh, that's true. What so for we, those of we you... Put, we put um, uh, seven minutes in a corner... With Baby Shark. With Baby Shark. Um, so we need another thing to replace. <laughs> Pardon me. What's something good? I don't even know. Kate, any ideas of uh, a, a potential punishment for if we lose... For, the, for when James inevitably loses that coffee punk tomorrow and has to roll it? Not with the baby shark, though, right? Well, we already have that, yeah. yeah. I don't know, chat, throw, throw some ideas in chat, too. We'll see, uh, we'll, we'll crowdsource this. Mm -hmm. I'd love to see what chat has to say as a suitable. Uh, for the few people in the challenge system who are asking for a minute of silence during Remembrance Day, that will happen. Don't, yeah, uh, It we will happen you. at 11 o'clock. Our time. Our time. Uh, so when this hits 11, we will take a moment of silence, uh, and when we get to that point, uh, we will discuss what Remembrance Day is all about. So it's going to happen. Oh right, I forgot. We already have secondary. We already have a secondary bet for tomorrow too. Yeah. The loser has to go to Hey Happy and buy um, buy something for all the other entertainers, which I think is very funny. Uh, there was a there's a pretty good answer I saw there. There's a couple of good ones. Which one did you see, Serge? I just forgot. Oh no! Back to the French bit. You have to speak. You have to speak French for the rest of the shift. I can't do that. Neither can Liz. <laughs> like I, I can't speak French, so I will just be sitting around silent. Say nothing. Yeah, yeah. say nothing. So that's that's a bad one. Yeah. If I was fluent in French, I'd be like, sure, I'll do it. I mean, it's going to be weird because most people in this building won't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> Like, well, I, there's an interesting one. So the chat's suggesting that maybe just to shake it up, that the winner spins the wheel. But then, then the punishment that comes up, James has. Uh, the, the loser, has, loser to do? has to do. I mean, yeah. I mean, uh, I don't. Uh, neither of us are really. What is that thing called? We have like a um, an animal onesie, Kigurumi. Yeah. I do not have one. No, but I imagine we could get a really awkward looking one. We'd have to wear it for us to shift. It'd be pretty good. Uh, loser has to do a Zeta shift? No! Uh, no, we don't want to We don't want to mess up people's sleep <laughs> schedules. <laughs> that's the whole reason we got rid of driver shifts. Yeah. I mean, it's a good idea. Like, it's a good punishment, but uh, it's bad. There was another one, which was loser has to stand for the rest of the shift, which, while hilarious, does make it awkward, because if we have to operate the bus or the, com I yeah. mean, I guess... I mean, it could be done. Like stand for the entire six-hour shift. Yeah, I mean, like that's. Well, the, there's another interesting one: is uh, that the winner has to, or the loser has to extol the virtues of the other every 20 minutes until the next pong game. I mean, we just do that anyways via challenges. Yeah. They're always trying to make me be nice to Surge. So what do you what do you think? I think that the two favorite ones I have right now are the the 
Kigurumi, Kigurumi, I don't even know how to, that word pronounces, uh, or the stand the whole time. And I realize it's a weird punishment. People are like, it's literally my job to be on my feet all day, eight days. I worked in kitchens, I get it. But, you know, when you're in a room full of people sitting, it, it's, it's, it's visually a punishment as well. Thoughts? Mm. I'm kind of meh on the standing one. Yeah, when I stood for six hours, I also had an exhaustion pad for my feet. It's also one that I will probably just forget. The standing one? Yeah, yeah. like I will yeah. probably just walk off camera at some point and sit down somewhere and be like, oh, whoops. All right, well, what about the Kigurumi thing then? So where are we, we need to go get one then? So, let's be real. Ben has one. Yeah. Uh, I think it's like a red panda one. I'm, I'm fairly certain Kelly has one. I want, We could probably ask them. I think they have like a unicorn one. Yeah. Which would be pretty interesting. Okay. I mean, I'm down. We could put that. So that would be like where the next day? Yeah. Just all day in that. Yeah. Which, uh... Well, which... I'll shift in that? I'll yes, shift. yes, yeah, yes. Like, yes. once the shift is done, you're done? They said they're saying See, Ben has a red panda. See, you're mentioning once the shift is done, you're done. That is not how the caramel dancing worked for me yesterday. Yeah, but you only had to do, like, two extra dances. I think if you show up and on camera was... later in the day, yes, James Turner, that's you fair. have to be wearing it. Yeah, if you still hang around the moon base, the moon base, if you still hang around the venue, uh, you have to be on camera in it. Interesting. Yeah. Or I or you know what <laughs> maybe banana suit. Oh, that I like that actually. Yeah, I banana like, suit. I think actually just banana suit. So if we roll it, banana suit starting right then. Yeah. But only till the end of your shift. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry about like the after because it's just a yeah. pain in the butt to be like, <laughs> like I, I don't I'm not because like yet last night I came back at around like six thirty seven to pick some people up and go for dinner and I popped on stage for a few minutes and I'm banana not gonna. Suit. I'm not going to put the banana suit back on if that's the case. That's fair. Yeah, I like I like banana suit. And okay. it's just something we have here, too. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. Banana yeah. suit sits strong. I think that's that may be the one. <laughs> but if Corey shows up, you have to fight. Yeah, that's fair. All right. Um, I can't write it down because I'm driving right now, but that will be replacing the uh, all-day RDP. Yeah, you know me. 